Hi friends, I'm TTB. Welcome back to MechWarrior 5 Mercenaries. Now, we still have to fulfill the rest of our contract here. We defended the food sources. Now it is time to go to the planet of Hyde and assassinate the Cretan Strike leader. Um, is there another contract we should maybe take here? Let's see. Training day. Uh oh, that's free mission operation. This will be against independence level 92. We could take some salvage, but not enough. That's kind of pointless. Yeah, yeah, no, we're traveling. We're traveling to our assassination mission, all the while repairing our mechs. Uh huh. I'm the proud owner of even more chargers. Actually, this thing we can instantly sell. It's crap. We know that. So, it's just cash in our pockets. That is nice. Uh, let's go to hide. Let's go to hide and see what happens. Mopit saying, remember TTB, you need to min-max your cantina missions, otherwise the YouTube comments will be very disappointed. Oh yeah. We had a gentleman being very distraught. He couldn't handle it. Level 80 assassination. Okay, we grab 27 pieces of salvage. Wow, that's nothing. Oh, well, let's go for cash then. Um, everything is repaired, actually. Should I maybe go for one of the awesomes? It's always a good mech for assassination. I'm gonna switch to Marauder to the Atlas. How should I be in the Cyclops, maybe? Hmm. Hmm. Because the Awesome was a nice mech. Definitely a nice mech. What should we do? Yeah, you know, we'll do that. I'm gonna be in the Awesome. Um. And then. This, no, this guy no, this guy is gonna be in the awesome. What am I talking about? I'm stupid. This guy is gonna be in the awesome and I'm gonna be in the Cyclops. There we go, that's what I wanted. Okay, looking good. Let's go. The Steiner Scout Lens reporting in. Time to assassinate a little bit. Not far from the landing zone is Tai E. Jules Tanaka. The commanding officer of a Curitan elite strike team. Tai E. Jules Tanaka. Under disguise in hopes of triggering a full-blown war between Marek and Steiner. You need to eliminate him and his troops in order to fully bury this plot. Not a problem. We can do that. First, we need to yeah need to get some beautiful screenshots here of our boys. Look at that. Like the mech models are amazing. Nice. Look at those beautiful screenshots that we're getting here. Even from the King Crab. Get it down a little bit further. Yes. Ah, sexy. Das Krabbe. Muss krabben. That's a light. Welcome in. Alright, let's get going here. Let's start assassinating. Oh, my my Steiner Scout Lens is too light? Really? Damn it. Oh, oh, look at that! TTB is in Loot Wonderland. We're finally getting some loot again. Yoink. Oh, it's triple loot. There's triple loot here. Last phase level 2. I think the loot overrid itself or something. That was weird. Excellent find, Commander. Beginning recovery now. Okay, apparently the rest is just just booked itself out. There, what is going on? It's up. the Loot Lord's Paradise! Oh, and I see an enemy. Evil enemies. Here's what? Alright, let's go. These guys are pissed, and I'm pissed as well. Ow. Go in there. What am I even shooting at? Scorpion light tank, okay. Oof! Misclicked. The mouse went too far. That's a miss. Everybody kill this guy. Whip. I'll kill this guy. 
That side also should pop any second here. There we go. Nice. Everybody go in. As a kill target. Another side of Stan Q. It's really hard to hit him in the cockpit. It? Ah, we're victorious! Alright, nice. There's still a light mech here. Panther! Of course, Panther. Classic Cretans. Oh! They're dropping in behind us! Classic House Kurita. Always going for the back door. Sneaky Asians. Yoink! That hit the cockpit. Didn't kill him though, but it hit the cockpit. Bye bye. Whip. Yoink! Okay, we can leave now. King Grab is taking too much damage for my tastes. Oh, it's actually pretty safe this whole round. And we're going back to where we came from. Alright. Back to the loot! Back to the loot! Dual AC-20 on the Slapnir is something we could also do. Yes, I agree. But Dual Gauss is just superior, in my opinion. It just has the range. It does not do that little more... Like It just does like two damage less than the AC-20. But it has like three times the range and like, what, five times the speed? It's just a superior weapon. The only thing that really bores me, or that really annoys me about the Gauss is that effect that you have that gunks up your screen that you can't see anymore. And it's just in your cockpit, like if you go third person, you don't have that issue. What? Cargo acquired? What do you mean? Oh! Maybe that was from before? I don't know. Rihanna, you're weirding me out right now. Doesn't matter though, we got our kill, we get our money. I think that Cyclops would also be nice for beachhead missions at 64 kph. Not bad. Real speed of the Gauss is a little bit slower, I believe. Ultra AC-20? <laughs> that doesn't exist, unfortunately. Why my chieftain says hi? Alright. Two large pulse lasers, tier 2. A small pulse laser, tier 2. And a large chem laser, tier 3. Alright. 8.5 million Seabell? Oh, that was too far. Dude, come back here. Get the Shadowhawk, get the PPC. Uh, get the medium laser. Uh, oh, there's really not that much loot to be had here. So let's grab the LRM10, I guess. Alright. House Kurita did not like what we did to them. This time, AI also did a very solid job. Look at this. This is what I like. This is what I like to see. The AI actually did two thirds of my damage. Absolutely fine. GG's. Not only have you earned the gratitude of two great houses. Representative from both our governments, we sure to leave favorable reports with the mercenary review board. We get an AC-20 tier 4, LRM-10 tier 4, SRM-2 tier 4, and SRM-6 tier 4 plus 2.4 million seabills and 1500 reputation. Nice. Any good contracts here for us? Jesus, left 4 mission operation, 4 mission operation? Nah. Not for us. Let's see. Um, got 24 million seabills. There's a new... Cantina available, and there's a high reward quest in Sheridan for the Free Birds League. Let's see what that's about. Let's see what that is all about. Uh, Cantina, anything for us? Equipment, treasure hunter. Do we ha do we have mech collector or trebuchet? Let's see if we have the me the mech ready. No, we don't have the mech ready. Okay, well then let's cancel this mission. Uh, pa 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 Are there superchargers you can buy? Nope. Any good weapons? The Solid Slugs LB10s are coming in now. And you can buy them somewhere like on the on these planets actually. It's quite nice. In war zones. Interesting. Uh, what's this mission here? Defend the Enhanced. Defend their bionics, clinics, and facilities. Against whom? 
get a PPC tier 5 for it and two double heat sinks. Okay. Alright. Doesn't seem to go against House Steiner. So, there are people who are racist against people who have bionic prostheses, and we need to defend them. Sure, that is a mission I can get behind. Level 87 defense. Okay, for that I would have needed to repair my max first though. I think that would, be, would have been prudent. Um, but that's okay, we have enough max to do that, I think. So, contract. Don't really get that much salvage out of it, right? 24 salvage? Yeah, that's kind of crap, so. We just go for cash. Uh, we might get a mech, though. I don't know. Let's go for full salvage. What the hell? Uh, in terms of mechs, though, what will we be running? I'm gonna be the Annihilator, then we will use what? Marauder. Awesome. Could use a Stalker, but the Stalker has proven itself to not be very good with the AI. Oh well. Let's try it. Let's try it. I want the double heat sinks. I definitely want the double heat sinks. Anti enhancement fanatics. See what I mean? Like it doesn't it doesn't zoom high forms. enough. Most I think the camera move is a little bit wrong. Maybe somebody can go up with a mod for that, that would be amazing. Because as a content creator, it would be so easy to get a nice screenshot at the beginning of the match where every mech is like close together, right? That would be amazing. But not always in the cards. Also, the mod is working. We are now a 48 kph annihilator. This feels a lot better. Feels a lot better. I would highly recommend this mod. 48 kph for annihilator is the speed you want. I wouldn't go faster than that, otherwise it gets OP, but 48. You need to be able to move at the same speed as your lands. 48 is like the slowest speed you want to go in Mech Warrior, in any Mech Warrior game. Uh, oh, we have water here. We could stand in the water and shoot from here. I'm not leaving this pool, guys. This is like a, this is like the super, super, supernova bug zapper standing in water. One shot, one kill, and he even got boof. Oh, that tank didn't last long. Gotta love it. We're paying you to protect us, not kill us. Jesus, it's that lady again. The lady that needs the cucumber. Oh, somebody somebody have some duct tape? I need somebody to duct tape her mouth shut. Radio just went static. Someone tell me what's happening. Jesus. I need to turn down those annoying base commanders. Rip. Watch what happens if I step into the water. Meow. Oh fuck. I just walked through the explosion, right? Ouch. Well, so much for that. Didn't do much damage though, so we're good. We're still good. Looks like you got the retention. The lady needs to be in one of the hostile tanks? Hostile. Yeah, I agree. That <laughs> way we could silence her once and for all. No geyser water reaction? Oh. Much heat sink, much value. Your immersion is ruined, says Becky. Uninstalling. Ha 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 ha. Oh, oh. Okay. Okay, well, we got some targets incoming here. That, uh, the Banshee's not gonna last very long. I'm gonna wait for her to join us up here, though. I'm not leaving my, my cool zone. This is the cool zone. No. Nope. Oh. Dragon. It's a dragon! Burn it! Burn it with fire! Okay, it's toad. Dude, what? What are you doing back there, dude? Okay, he's just being weird. Alright. Oh, Stalker's going for it! It's going for it! That's a crappy banshee, by the way. Doesn't want to die, but he's... Rip. Maybe we can grab a Vulcan here. By destroying it enough. By being inaccurate enough. Rip. 
This mech is, I think, one of the most damage dealing mechs in the whole game. If you can stand in water. The bug zapper. Large uh, chem lasers in general. I like chem lasers a lot. Yeah, OP cooling is OP. Oh yeah. Uh oh. Watch your head, mate! Oof. Oh. Okay, so we've got three targets on the right, and then a couple of dudes coming in here. That's fine. We'll deal with them. Where are the boys going, by the way? Oh, what? Stalker. Alright. Scorpion light tank over here. Vindicated. I can't really deal with the lights right now. I need to kill the big boys, so. Let's clear the way. Clear the guardhouse. Oh no! There was loot in there. Never mind. Somebody in Tarkov is crying bitter tears right now. Uh, you can, guys can deal with the tank. I'm gonna deal with that banshee. How about that, huh? I'm just gonna keep sawing on that banshee. Ripping it apart piece by piece, I guess. The problem is it has like a it has a CT small laser or, or cockpit small laser, so even if you take out that side torso, you're still not gonna punch out. There comes a stalker. Oh, he's got full SRM6. That's dangerous. Side toss away as fast as possible. Is he shooting my buddy? That's not cool. Now he's looking at me! Rip. Okay, this build is kind of OP if you're standing in the water. It's, it's not even funny. <laughs> it's not even funny anymore. It's just like I'm, I'm playing very German right now. I mean, of course, this is also a, uh, a more cool planet, right? The frozen planet. So, that also helps. I think there was a tank here somewhere. This guy's just destroying everything in our base. Okay, they're dropping in behind us. Uh, dude. Oh, there you are. Give me the leg boy. You don't need it anymore. How much leg armor do you have? There we go. No more legs. There's also a tank here. Wasn't the radar supposed to be 360 degree right now? I'm not feeling it as much. Oof. That's a lot of targets. Let's go for that Marauder. I need to go into the water though to get the full firepower here. Get the side torso off. It's a Lurm boat. I don't like that. It's gonna hurt. Marauder gone. Can we get this guy fast? I need him this level. Okay. Jesus, why are you all shooting at me? Y'all got a giant hard on for my mech. Rip. Alright. Azores! Azores! Alright. Last guy is the awesome, I think. I think I would have died here without the OP cooling. I would have probably died here. Too many targets on me and nobody attacking my teammates. But we still have some armor left. I mean, we have basically zero armor left, but the structure is intact, so we're fine. Uh, that mech just went through the floor. Okay. Creepy ghost mech. Hello! How's it going there, bud? Ripperoni Jabroni! That was a headshot, I think. Alright, the settlement is safe. TTB is annihilator, reigns supreme. Everything is good. Everything is good. Yeah, 48k pH feels a lot better on the annihilator. Feels a lot better. It feels like it should feel. 2 million C bills, and we get what? I can actually get a hunchback here. Not bad. 
And the PPC on top? No. Burst fire. AC5 on top and then maybe an LRM5. Okay. Not bad. 2.2k damage almost in that time frame. The AI didn't get to shoot anything. <laughs> the bug zapper, boys. It is super, super powerful. The only thing I, I think that could do more damage in the bug zapper would be um, probably that SRM6, SRM4 archer, if it's standing in the water. But it has half the range of the bug zapper, so harder to use. GG's. Uh, what about the quest? Oh, we have to travel further? Okay. Well, there's a secondary part to this mission. And we will do that in the next episode. Let's have this one a little bit shorter. And you guys let me know in the comments on YouTube below, by the way. Do you prefer, like, super long videos or do you prefer shorter episodes, like 20-30 minutes? Let me know in the comments down below.